Hello guys, welcome to uh my first ever graded uh mystery pack opening. I've never done something like this, so I thought let's try something new. We don't ever do this. We've never open graded uh graded cards on this channel before. So I thought we shall give it a try. So I got zoo packs. These I bought these off Amazon. Uh I'll leave a link in the description. Uh advise that i don't promote this obviously everything is luck based everything is chance based so if you if i get something crazy good i don't want you guys to go and buy this thinking oh i'll get something crazy good i don't know what i'm gonna get but yeah just i'm just putting that uh out there that i don't advise buying these i don't know what these are yet so let me open them i'm not gonna promote these by like oh go, go buy them i'm just putting a disclaimer out there that everything buy at your own accord uh it's just a disclaimer so uh with that out the way i kind of want to like rise it a little bit so you guys have more of like a viewpoint we'll start with one of these so each one of these i believe was about 30 bucks uh it might have been more 35 ish and it guarantees a booster pack in here i don't know what era they're gonna go for booster packs but it also guarantees uh authentic graded card so I've seen a lot more bigger channels do this. So let me see if this is this is the right way. Right? So it's gonna I've seen a lot bigger channels than me do this. So that's why I thought, hey, let's give it a try. So first of all, let's look at the two packs that we get. We got a Paradox Rift and a Trick or Treat pack. Wonderful. But we can start with the graded card. Okay. It is from GMA. I don't know if GMA is a good greeting company, but bang! It's an Arcanine from... What is this? It's an Ar... Whoa. It's a 7. Wow. It's from... It's from 1999, which is kind of crazy. Wow. Okay. I don't know how to feel about that. I'll, I'll check the prices. And maybe I'll put them on the screen. Maybe I won't. But I don't know if we're going to make our money back. Because I don't know anything about the graded card market at all. This is this video is kind of me delving into the graded card market. And how I feel about it. And stuff like that. If I want to start grading cards or not. Because I know it takes a year to get your graded cards back. And that's not... I don't have patience like that. But next we can open these packs. We got a trick or treat pack. Um... The, were these 2023 or 2022? These are from 2022. So we got a thump, got that, and a drift loom. Wonderful. Wonderful. But we do have a Paradox Rift pack to open here. So you can open that. All right. There's the code card. And here we go. We got a Jirachi. Nope. Parcel Lady. Porygon 2, Zebra Strike, Luxurious Cape, A Punk for Little, Nope. And the, I'm not going to expect any pulls from this because I feel like they probably weighed the packs. But yeah, sorry if I'm going a little slow, but you know, I feel like these, these should have a little momentum. Is this, I want something from PSA, if I'm being 100% honest. This is from GMA again. Let's open the packs. No, actually, we won't. It's Paradox Rift again. Okay. Well, we have Trick or Treat and Paradox Rift once again. Let's see what this is. Three, two, one. Bang! Oh, okay. It's a 1999 Raticate. I don't think this is going to go for much at all. But it's also a 7. See, now I'm feeling like this wasn't worth the investment that I made. Okay. Okay. I again I'm gonna be a hundred percent honest once again. I do not advise buying this. I do not advise buying this. So yeah. You know, buy your own disclosure or whatever the word is. I don't even know what the word is. But here we go. We can open a trick or treat pack. I don't even know if there's a pull in the trick or treat packs at all. Cause I never opened these. Yeah, I mean, yeah. It is what it is. I've never opened these trick or treat packs personally, but I don't know how to feel about this, man. 
Like a part of me, I feel like I got ripped off. Let me know in the comments that I get ripped off. There's the code card. But we got a Hone Edge, the Weeble, Joltik, Horsey, Charlton, Garbador, Evolution, Bon Sweet, Peekaboo, and then that. And then the last one. Come on. Give me at least a, you know, something. It's another GMA. And is it gonna, oh my god, it's gonna be the same thing again. It's the same exact packs. So I'm guess I'm guessing this is gonna be a 7 again. If I had to guess, this is gonna be another PSA. It's a, uh, this is gonna be another 7. 3, 2, 1, bang. Yep, it's another 7. <sighs> Wow. Wow. That is horrible. I mean, I put $100 into this. Wow. I mean, at least, at least we, I mean, I bought these from Amazon, so be careful, guys. I'm not going to put a link of these in the description. But, yeah, it is what it is, right? You know, Maybe there was going to be a Charizard in here, but there wasn't. All right, here we go. Got a Pulse. We got a Toxel. We got a Lyperd. We got a Wompot. Scenario. Orthworm. Minshu. That. And that. I also have, later this week, there's also going to be another mystery type of pack opening. So hopefully that one goes a lot better. And by this week, seeing how these mystery packs do will depend uh it will depend if i do these this type of content more often um but yeah i mean a P three psa sevens i don't think is good i don't know about this arcanine this arcanine might be cool i think it's just cool for me to have an arcanine uh kind of uh, arcanine is one of my favorite pokemons so i'll take him as a graded card i don't know about radicate and i don't know about omasar but yeah it is what it is uh don't forget to like comment so actually comment what you guys think of this right let me let me know should i do this more often should i take more risk do more uh like mega cube mystery boxes or mystery boxes from ebay mystery boxes from amazon mystery packs from amazon or ebay stuff like that if i'm being 100 percent honest right now i'm just trying to get to that eight minute mark um if you guys made it this far i love you uh but don't forget to like don't forget to comment how you guys feel about this stuff let me know i i know i don't feel the greatest about this stuff but um yeah don't forget to like don't forget to comment don't forget to subscribe and don't forget about the membership uh and yeah i'm done plugging don't forget to like comment subscribe i'll get you guys in the next video